Hi, my lovelies. I hope you're all well. So I, today, I just want to show you on the iOS app, so that's iPad or iPhone, how you can change the operation type of your image or your text. So first of all, I'm just going to click on the whole image and you can see that it's currently grouped together because when I click on it, all of the layers turn grey. So that shows me that it's grouped. If I come to the bottom of my panel and I go to edit, you can see that right here we've got basic cut and operation. If I click on that, I've got the operation. I can select the drop down menu and it will give me the options available depending on the machine that I'm set to. So I could choose pen, select a colour and apply and it will change the whole thing to pen or I could go back in, drop down the menu, I could select engrave and you'll see that all of the layers are then engrave. So depending on the machine that I'm selected to will depend upon the options that I get. The other thing that I can do is I can choose specific elements of the image to be something different. There's two ways I can do this. I can either use my layers panel to select the individual elements or if I come to actions and ungroup, I can ungroup my layers so that they become individual and I can then select them using my canvas. So my stars, I'm going to go to edit, operation, we're going to change that to a basic cut and apply. Choose, we're going to go to operation. We're going to change that to pen and apply. And then happy, we can leave as engrave. And there we go. In its basic form, that's how we can change the operation type. Now, it changes when things are attached or things are welded, but we will look at those in another video. For now, we're just looking at things in their very basic forms just to make it nice and easy. As always, thank you so much for joining me. I hope this has been helpful. If you've got any comments or questions, please do leave them below and I'll see you all again soon. Bye.